Well, happening today in Baton Rouge, the Baton Rouge Fire Department is looking for some new faces to join the team. NBC Local 33's Courtney Williams is live this morning, keeping it kicking with uh, the Baton Rouge Fire Department. She's at headquarters this morning with more on what those who are wanting to apply can expect. Courtney, good morning to you. Good morning, Jan and Carly. Yes, I'm still here at the Baton Rouge Fire Department headquarters, and here I have with me Chief of Training, Mr. Dwayne Stevens. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm good. Doing good. So kind of just tell me about just, you know, what people can expect when during the training process. Well, when they start training, uh, they come in. The first few months, we take them through EMT, Emergency Medical Technician. After that, then we get on the fire side of it. It's a little bit more exciting, a little bit more outside work. Uh, we're able to get outside, do some evolutions. At the end of fire training, we go to LSU and we actually put them through some live burns, uh, which is a little bit more exciting. Kind of get them a little bit familiar with what to expect when they get on the floor. Okay, um, so are some people, you know, surprised about what, um, how much it takes, you know, just being a firefighter? Oh yeah, they, the first day is always the best day, especially when we start doing PT. Uh, they think, you know, with it, it's not that much to it. And the first day they kind of have a little eye opener and kind of see what it's really about, the physical fitness, the, the mental state more than anything that you have to be in to undertake some of the jobs that we have to do. And um, what comes at the end of the training process? Well, once we get them all trained and uh, get their minds on track of being a firefighter, they'll graduate, uh, they'll go to different stations, you know, for about a year, they will circulate through the city, see what stations they like, and kind of get to see the city in a different aspect rather than just being at one station. All right, awesome. So, again, if you're interested in becoming a firefighter, you can still apply. The deadline is tomorrow at midnight, but for more information on that, you can go to our free Be Our Proud app, or you can go to our website at BeOurProud.com. Live at the Baton Rouge Fire Department headquarters, Courtney Williams. Back to you guys in the studio.